Russia's wild frontiers test the toughest. Arctic blizzards bury roads, temperatures drop to minus 70, and challenging terrains defy ordinary trucks. But Russia's cargo haulers are built for this harsh environment. These five titans, designed for military and industrial strength, carry their loads where no road dares to tread. Buckle up. These beasts don't just endure the storm, they conquer it. Paven Avtoros Shaman. The Avtoros Shaman is a Russian 8x8 amphibious ATV introduced in 2014, designed for extreme off-road adventures like hunting and rescue missions. It has a payload capacity of 1.5 to 2 tons and can traverse diverse terrains, including swamps and snow, thanks to low-pressure tires and a sealed hull that allows water travel at 7 kilometers per hour. With crab walk steering and three driving modes, off-road sideways, it has a turning radius of under 25 feet. It's powered by a 3.0-liter Ivaco turbo diesel engine, 215 horsepower, 330 pound-feet torque, with a six-speed transmission reaching speeds of 80 kilometers per hour on roads and two kilometers per hour off-road with a fuel consumption of approximately 20 liters per 100 kilometers and a 300 liter tank. Measuring 6 meters by 2.5 meters by 3 meters and weighing approximately 5.5 tons, it can seat up to 9 people and operates in extreme temperatures from minus 60 degrees Celsius to plus 50 degrees Celsius. While not ideal for heavy industrial hauling, its amphibious capabilities make it exceptional for specialized missions in challenging environments. Four, the Burlak. Introducing the Burlak, a six by six amphibious off-road vehicle designed by Makar Off-Road in 2015 for Arctic expeditions. It features 1.75 meters low pressure tires and a sealed hull that enables navigation in snow, ice, mud, and water at eight kilometers per hour. Powered by a Kamaz diesel engine, 200 to 300 horsepower. It carries two tons of cargo or 10 to 15 passengers and handles steep inclines. With dimensions of 6.6 .6 meters by 2.9 meters by 2 meters, it has adjustable ground clearance and a 400 liter fuel tank, consuming approximately 30 liters per 100 kilometers. The Burlak operates in temperatures from minus 60 degrees Celsius to plus 50 degrees Celsius and includes bunk beds, a kitchen, and heating. Equipped with a winch for self-recovery, it is essential for extreme exploration and Emercom exercises. Three, NERPA 550. Introducing the NERPA 550, the world's largest amphibious hovercraft and a Russian powerhouse from the Zuber class, Project 12322. Originally developed for military use in the 1980s, it now assists in mining, oil exploration, and emergency logistics. With a length of 187 feet, width of 84 feet, and height of 17.7 feet, it weighs 340 tons empty and 555 tons loaded. Powered by four gas turbines and two diesel engines, generating approximately 24,000 horsepower. It reaches speeds of 69 miles per hour and has a range of over 621 miles on diesel. The NERPA 550 can carry three tanks, 10 vehicles, or 500 passengers, excelling in extreme conditions and priced at over $100 million.
two, Kamaz 43,118. Introducing the Kamaze 43,118, a rugged Russian 6x6 all-wheel drive truck designed for tough terrains since 1995. Evolving from the Kamaze 43,010, it features a reinforced chassis, approximately 300 millimeters ground clearance, and optional cranes, capable of hauling 10 tons or towing 32,700 kilograms. Powered by a 260 horsepower Kamaz 740.30 V8 diesel engine, it reaches speeds of 100 kilometers per hour and can ford 1.5 meter rivers, measuring 9.66 meters long and weighing around 8.3 tons. It has a GVW of 21,600 kilograms and fuel consumption of 33 liters per 100 kilometers. With a winch and the ability to tackle 45 degree inclines, the Kamaz E 43118 excels in extreme conditions from minus 50 degrees Celsius to plus 50 degrees Celsius. Introducing the Vityaz DT-30, a Soviet-era articulated tracked vehicle launched in 1982. Designed for extreme terrains, it features two linked units that can navigate swamps, arctic ice, sand dunes, and deep snow. With a ground pressure of 0.22 to 0.35 kilograms per square centimeter, it has a 30-ton payload, tows up to 40 tons, and is vital for Gazprom's operations and Emercom rescues in the far north and Antarctica. Powered by a 710 horsepower YMZ 238 V12 diesel engine, it reaches speeds of 45 to 50 kilometers per hour on roads and 5 to 8 kilometers per hour in water. Measuring 11.8 meters long, 3.2 meters wide, and 3.6 meters tall. It can handle 35 degree inclines and 2.5 meters ditches in extreme temperatures. Variants like the DT-30P and DT-30K cranes enhance its utility. Fun fact, the DT-30 featured in the film, the geographer drank his globe away. The Avtoros Shaman, Borlak, Arctica, Hovercraft, Kamaz 43118, and Vityaz DT-30 are exceptional Russian vehicles built for extreme terrains like swamps, Arctic ice, and deep snow. The Shaman's 8x8 agility and the Burlak's amphibious design help them navigate harsh environments, including temperatures as low as minus 60 degrees Celsius. The Arctica glides over ice. The Kamaz 43,118 powers through mud, and the tracked Vityaz DT-30 can carry 30 tons across tundra and rivers, showcasing Russia's engineering capabilities for mining, rescues, and exploration. <laughs>